Okay, so let's solve this problem. So to write this equation in a general form, so first, we need to multiply every terms by these two denominators. So this becomes 6 times 9 times for this term, that's x plus 3 to the power 2 then over 6 then plus for this term. So we have 6 times 9 then times y minus 4 to the power 2 then over 9 then equals for this term. So that's 6 times 9 then times 1. Then to simplify, so we can cancel the 6. So we have 9 times x plus 3 to the power 2 plus cancel this 9. So we have 6 times y minus 4 to the power 2 then equals multiply these numbers. So 6 times 9 times 1, that's 54. Then simplify, so we have 9 times, we can write this one as x plus 3 times x plus 3, then plus 6 times y minus 4 times y minus 4, then equals 54. Then using the FOIL method, so we have 9 times x times x, that's x squared, and x times 3, that's positive 3x. Then 3 times x, positive 3x. 3 times 3, that's positive 9. Then plus 6 times y times y, that's y squared. y times negative 4, that's negative 4y. This one is negative 4y and negative 4 times negative 4. That's positive 16. Then equals 54. Then simplify. So we have 9 times x squared. Then this 3x plus 3x. So plus 6x. Then plus 9. Then plus 6 times y squared. This negative 4y negative 4y negative 8y then plus 16 equals 54. Then this time distribute this 9. So 9 times x squared, that's 9x squared. 9 times 6x, that's positive 54x. And 9 times 9, that's positive 81. Then plus... For this term, so 6 times y squared, that's 6y squared. 6 times negative 8, so negative 48y. And 6 times 16, that's positive 96. Then transpose this positive 54, that becomes negative 54, then equals 0. Then combine like terms, so we have now 9x squared, then plus 54x, so this 81 plus 96 minus 54, so we have 81 plus 96 minus 54, then equals, that's 123. So plus 123, then plus 6y squared, then minus 48y, then equals 0. Then arrange this equation, so we can rewrite this one as 9x squared plus 6y squared, then plus 54x, then minus 48y then plus 123 equals 0. So this is now the general form of this given standard 
equation.